In this exercise, you have to conjugate the verb in future and we will follow the rule according to the verb given in the sentence. The first verb is to be, uh, to be uh, it's according to the notes, a uh, third group irregular verb for future tense. So you have to memorize the base, which is S-E-R. And to that base, we will add, add the ending, which is A-I for the subject, je. So je serai présent, I will be present. Second verb is to come. They, to come late. So to come, venir, it's a third group, again, irregular verb. So you have to memorize the base, which is V-I-E-N-D-R. And the ending for this uh, verb here, it's O-N-T because the subject is ILS. So they will come late. Ils viendront tard. Third sentence, you to feel well. To feel, it's a third group verb. It's irregular for present tense, but for future, it's regular, means the base is the infinitive form. And uh, the ending for this uh, conjugation will be Z because the subject is vous. And SC will change into vous because it's a uh, reflexive verb and it doesn't affect the conjugation rule anyways we have mentioned mentioned we have mentioned many times so vous vous sentirez is the conjugation for future tense for this verb you will feel well fourth one you to eat a cake you will eat a cake to eat it's a first group verb regular rule infinitive form is the base and the ending it's uh, AS for the subject tu. So tu mangeras un gâteau. You will eat a cake. Fifth one. We to write a letter. To write it's a third group irregular verb. And the rule for this verb is to cut E to get the base. So E-C-R-I-R -R is the base. And the subject is nous. So the Ending will be ONS. Nous écrirons une lettre. We will write a letter. The sixth one. She to clap. Uh, to clap, it's a second group verb. A regular rule. Infinitive form is the base. And the subject is ELLE. -L -L -E, so the ending is A. So elle applaudira. She will clap. So the future tense, it's quite easy actually to conjugate compared to present tense. Just remember the rules.